Happy February. 2024 has started with a bang. There's been a flurry of events and some challenging state budget news, and there's also been really no shortage of activity in the local government space. This is actually our first full newsletter of the year, and I am so excited to share some things we're really looking forward to in the coming weeks. February, as you know, is the season of love, and there are a few things we really love that we get to highlight this month. In the area of leadership, we're very much looking forward to seeing some of our city leaders at the City Managers Conference in Los Angeles next week. In addition to highlighting some key issues affecting local governments, we're also going to be out there promoting some new research and a survey that we're doing in partnership with San Diego State and San Diego University about professional development needs in the public sector. The best leaders are built through education and continuous improvement, and we want to know more about how to kind of build up our current and future local government leaders. As you know, we also love public engagement and our popular new meeting mastery training is actually backed by popular demand and accepting registrations. In this election year, it's always important to be thoughtful about how we can run effective, engaging and productive public meetings. That's the key really to building trust is learning how to facilitate those and facilitate uh, in a way that people feel connected um, despite the complexity of what may be the season of content. So we hope you will register. There's information in the newsletter on how to do that. Sustainability and climate, as you know, have been a big part of ILG's portfolio of work for years. That's near and dear to our hearts. Team ILG will actually be at the Strategic Growth Council's Catalyst Conference this week, representing local government perspectives on climate, on infrastructure, and sustainable development. We absolutely love collaboration and shared values, and our partner, SGC, does a really great job convening stakeholders to find that common ground. And last but not least, we love our people. Those in public service and those looking to find a pathway to successful careers and some meaningful work. There are a lot of workforce development projects in motion at ILG right now. You've probably heard about a few of them. We have an open call for HR success stories for our IDEA project, and we hope you'll share your wins with us. Tell us about the good things. Tell us about what's working. Tell us about how you're making strides to bring in new people into your agency. I'll also be facilitating a conversation next week at an event hosted by our IPPS partner, Valley Vision and SMUD. We'll be talking about public sector apprenticeships and work-based learning and opportunities for younger employees to enter into the public sector. And on a more personal note, we are very, very excited that Team ILG is growing. In January, we welcomed our newest team member, Christy Jewell, who brings a wealth of experience in workforce development and higher education partnerships. She's joining us as a senior program manager, and Christy's going to make sure that there's a strong link between local government and our education institutions statewide, including connecting the dots between curriculum and career pathways. We're also over the moon to welcome back Carly Brown, a longtime ILG employee who has been on leave for a few months. We have missed Carly and we're so glad she's back with us. As a reminder, we love you too. Local government public servants have a difficult job and in these difficult times, your resilience, your passion and your commitment really make all the difference. Thank you for everything that you're doing for the cities, counties and special districts in California. We appreciate you. We're grateful for you. We hope you have an amazing month. Thank <laughs> you.